Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So if you're new here, my name is Nengi and I record fashion, travel and lifestyle videos. And today's video is going to be all about what's in my bag. But before we get into that, please don't forget to subscribe, leave a thumbs up if you like any of my videos and yeah, leave a lovely comment as well. But please, please, please subscribe. I'm on a road to get 1000 subscribers. So it would really mean a lot to me. But without further ado, let's get into my bag. So I'd say the first item in my bag is my phone, but I tend to hold my phone a lot. I feel like if I put it in my bag, I might get confused whereabouts it is. So I tend to hold my phone a lot or put it in my pocket. It doesn't really stay in my bag because in my hand, I just know that it's always there. So the bag in question is my Chanel bag. And it might look small to you, but there are a lot of things that can fit in this bag, as you will see very soon. So first we have hand sanitizer. Well, even before COVID, I always carried hand sanitizer with me because my mom always drained, drilled it in us that, you know, even if you're not washing your hands, you gotta have hand sanitizer so that your hands can be clean at different times. So yeah, this is very important. Now, what else do I carry? So I'm prone to having sore throats. I don't know why, so I always have some lockets with me and I love this flavor of lockets it's the honey and lemon so it's very menthol and it's soothing to my throat so yeah I always have lockets with me next item is hand cream so this is Crabtree and Evelyn hand cream it's really nice smells really good actually I should put a little bit on now I hate dry hands so definitely not not the one you cannot be having ashy hands and also sometimes when i wear heels i'll find that like my ankle or my heel is a little bit dry so it's not only hand cream it's the whole body cream for me um next thing yes spearmint i always have chewing gum i don't chew chewing gum that much but i have it in case someone wants some or maybe if i feel like i've just had a meal that's a bit musty so i think that spare mint is really good but yeah i'm not a regular chewing gum chewer but i always have it just in case next up we have my translucent powder this translucent powder is from lancome and i just really like it like it's not any specific tone so i feel like it suits different um skin tones but it's really good for like blotting if I'm getting a bit oily, but I don't tend to carry much makeup with me. I do my makeup and set everything as well as I can. And then I literally just get my translucent powder for moments where I feel a bit oily or the day is getting longer than I, you know, assumed it would. <laughs> then we have pocket tissue. I always have pocket tissue because I feel like I always have a runny nose, even in the summer, it's very weird. So I feel like it's just perfect for me and it's just something that I can carry around with me. And sometimes something spills, I need to wipe something before I sit or I could be in like a public place or like public toilets. I mean, I hover, but at the same time, you, you need tissue if you wanna just be a bit cleaner. So yeah, pocket tissue, very important to me. Next up we have, I have a snack. So. I carry a snack sometimes if I'm on the go and I get a bit hungry. And these snacks are the Belgian milk chocolate rice cakes from M&S. I really like them. I feel like rice cakes are quite healthy, but the ones with the chocolate at the back might not be as healthy, but it's a nice sweet treat. And yeah, it fills me up from time to time when I just need something to keep me going. So I really like the snack. Next up, we have my earphones. Now this is actually the ghetto because I need AirPods, but I had these Anchor Bluetooth earphones, which were even better than these because at least those ones, although they have a wire, they just sit behind your neck. These ones are just annoying because they get caught in door handles and everything. But at the same time, I love music so much, so I can't go anywhere without something to listen to music. Even if they're not AirPods, any other brand, I just have to have headphones with me all the time. Next up, I have my keys, um, this is a no-brainer. I have my keys to my house. And I really like this key holder. I got this in Barcelona a couple years ago. Actually, what am I saying, not Barcelona, Miami. I just realized it says South Beach, so yeah, it's definitely Miami. So it has Lincoln Road, 
South Beach and also has my like little fork for the um, security alarm in my house and this little thing that resembles a one pound coin because sometimes I'd be going shopping and I don't have a pound coin so I need to put it into the trolley so it can let me use the trolley. So yeah, this is my key and history of my key holder. <laughs> Wow, you didn't think all this would be my bag, I'm so sure. Um, power bank. This is probably the most important thing I have in my bag. Everyone who knows me, like all my friends who know me, know me for having and carrying a power bank with me. And I think it stemmed from when I had the iPhone 6. So I was one of those people who had really old phones. Like all my friends would get the new phones and I'll still have the old phone. So it was all about if it ain't broke, don't fix it. But this iPhone 6 was really broke. I had it for almost four years, guys. I moved from a six to an 11, which I have now. Imagine, seven, eight, nine, 10. I think there was seven, I don't know. All the numbers passed me by. I moved from a six to an 11, guys. Next up, this is very rare. I have a 20 pound note and I live in the UK. So 20 pounds is, yeah. I don't know what the equivalent of 20 pounds is in dollars, but this is very rare for me. I hardly, hardly carry money, but my mum recently got in from traveling and she gave me like 40 pounds to do something and I just have the other 20 with me. So yeah. Next up, we have all my cards. I really should have a card holder because what is this? I feel like I'm playing, I'm actually playing a game. What is going on here? Um, I believe that is it. Oh, last but not least, I have, I always take like a bit of perfume with me just in case I'm out long, longer than I anticipated. So spritz myself from time to time. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is Twilly de Hermes Eau de Parfum. So that smells, mm, that smells really good. Maybe I might get the full bottle. Oh. Yeah, so I carry this with me wherever I am, just to have something to quickly spritz in case I'm going somewhere more exciting and important and if I feel like I just need some refreshing. So guys, that's the end of the video and I bet you didn't think everything in here could fit into this bag. And I'm sure some more things can fit, but this is honestly what I carry day to day in my bag. And obviously I've shown you the most important bits, but yeah, I really like it and I hope you do too. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and please don't forget to subscribe, leave a thumbs up if you like my videos, leave me a comment below as well and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.